Efendim herkese merhabalar. Ben ilk her zaman Uzaktan Kumandanın 20 bölümüne karşınızdayız. Yanımda Nalan Apa var. Merhabalar ilk her zaman. Merhaba Nalan Hanım. <gülüyor> ben yine ne olur şunu şöyle tutayım. Ne tamam. olur ne olmaz diye. Siz Hı-hı. tutun. Tamam. Kendileri bugüne bugün sokak röportajlarının ustası efendim yani. <gülüyor> Biz anca böyle malzemeyi tutarız <gülüyor> taşıyoruz. Nasılsın Nalancığım? İyi misin? İyiyim. Sen nasılsın? İlk ay görüşmeyeli. İyi. Allah ne olsun. Birliği gibi koşturuyoruz. Sevgili arkadaşlar. Türkiye ve de Amerika birbirine vize yasağı koydu biliyorsunuz. Biraz kafalar karışmış orada. Türkiye'den aslında vize başvurusu yapamıyorsunuz. Evet. Ama Türkiye dışında mesela en yakından örnek vereyim. Hep ona örnek veriyorum. Bulgaristan Sofya'ya gidip Oradaki konsolosluktan vize başvurunuzu yapabilirsiniz. Yani Türk vatandaşlarına vize vermiyorum demiyor. Hayır. Amerikan konsolosluğu Hayır. ya da devleti. Türkiye'deki konsolosluklarını geçici süre kapattım diyor. Şimdi şunu sormamız lazım. Biz de aynı şekilde misilleme yaptık ki bence en doğru karardı. Evet. Hı hı. Dedik ki biz de vermiyoruz o zaman arkadaş dedik. Ya hı hı. online ya da kapıda Türkiye vizesi alıyordu Amerikalılar. Şimdi onlar da onu alamıyorlar. Bir soralım millete. Amerika ve Türkiye birbirine vize yasağı uygulamasını sürdürüyor. Bu konu hakkında ne düşünüyorsunuz? Buyursunlar. What do you think about the recent visa suspension between US and Turkey? I'd have to say that it's uh, it's kind of a surprise. I don't see that there's any uh, conflict between the two countries that would warrant warrant such a uh, an act. So you're surprised. I am surprised. It was news to me. I, I wasn't really aware of, of it. Um, and you could you could run down the list of all the countries that have been put on some list as in regards to either the Muslim countries or something in the Middle East. And it's um, it's all kind of a surprise. And I think it's more of a just a posturing mm-hmm. of the U.S. government um, or Trump. Oh, the visa suspension? Yes. Oh, um... I don't think it's good. I think that they should be able to come to the United States. Um, my husband is from Italy, Turin, Italy. Oh. And so we've been through the immigration process. Uh-huh. So, uh, yeah, I don't I don't think it's good. Yeah. And have you heard that also Americans are not, uh, I mean, they can't get the visa to enter Turkey as well. It's not only the Turkish people, but it's the Americans as well. Have you heard of that? Uh, I was not aware of that, mm-hmm. but uh, I, I I do not agree. I do not agree. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think that Americans should be able to go to Turkey as well, and uh, as well as the Turkish people. Yes, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and as well as vice versa. Know anything about it? Unfortunately, I mean, did this just happen? Just a little bit more than a week. Oh, okay. Well, I, it's probably ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, Turkey's you know a good important country and an important ally and a secular you know good con- country in mm-hmm. in an area of the world where we need allies I think it's really a bad thing why uh, because Turkey and the United States have always been good allies and friends and mm-hmm. and all of a sudden the relationships gone south so it's not a good thing in US and Turkey I have actually no idea about it What do you think about the recent visa suspension between U.S. and Turkey? Oh, I didn't even know about it. <laughs> I don't know anything. It's a difficult one, isn't it? Because Turkey's becoming increasingly unstable from what you hear and what you understand. The slightly unstable president, as it were, at the moment. I, I can see why. I don't really have enough information to comment on it. I'm sorry. Oh, there's a lot of issues with our president right now with um, visas and immigration and um, I'm hoping that the Supreme Court or someone will help figure it out so that people won't be stranded away from their families and things like that. Tell me about it. I didn't know Turkey and the U.S. had that. I knew there were some problems going on. but It's been a little more than a week. It's a recent thing. No, I, I'm glad I didn't know. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> What do you think about the recent visa suspension between U.S. and Turkey? I didn't even know that we did that, to tell you the truth. I'm surprised, though. I wouldn't think because I, anytime I've heard about Turkey, it's a more progressive country. It's about 10 days ago. 10 days ago it happened. Yeah. They... I don't even have to respond to that. I don't know. I'm sorry. I didn't know there was such a thing that happened. <laughs> the business, uh, no comment. I, have I don't no have comment. enough information. I, have done, I don't know anything. Don't I'm just enjoying the beach. I think that's just a diplomatic way of discriminating against the Turkish people. 
there's no basis in fact or in any evidence that we've seen that the Turkish people pose any threat to the United States whatsoever. I think it's done by the Trump administration for their own political gains without any level of justification because there's Turkish has been a great ally with the United States for many years, and there's no reason at this point in time to impose that travel ban and punish people who have not posed, do not pose a threat otherwise. Terrible. Terrible. Mm -hmm. Yes. Any other comments? Well, we should be allies. So we should, in my opinion, we should be uh, finding a way to communicate with each other diplomatically. Thank you. The question is, what do you think about the recent visa suspension between U.S. and Turkey? I have no idea. Uh, I wasn't even aware there was a visa suspension between Turkey and U.S. Is that one of the countries where the, uh, the uh, Muslims come from? It is, but it's not among the uh, visa ban. It's a very recent... I, is it one that President Trump has said that, that they're a, a threat to this country? Is that included in the countries? No. So it's a very recent decision. It's been a week ago. Yeah, uh, I, I just, I just let me tell you this. I'm for very strong security for this country. Oh, I haven't heard of it, unfortunately. Oh, uh, I actually didn't know that. What do you think about the recent visa suspension between Turkey and U.S.? The recent visa suspension. What do you think about the recent visa suspension between U.S. and Turkey? I have no idea. No, uh, no opinion on it. I have actually not heard about it, but that seems ridiculous to me. Um, did you I, hear I, about it? Yeah, I did. Oh, okay. I think it's uh, pretty unfortunate. Mm -hmm. I don't know much about it, but I'm not really in favor of restrictions on visas between countries. Uh, you know, I, I, I've been really busy with work, so I haven't been following up on that. I don't know anything about it. I don't know anything about it. Yeah. I. I don't either. I'm she not. works for a Turkish family too. Really? I yeah. do, but I don't know anything about that. I mean, it's a recent thing. It's like 10 days, 10 days. but oh, still. Okay. It's all good. Yeah. Okay. So we know nothing about it. Yeah. You know? I have heard somewhat about it, but I don't care to comment. I don't know a lot about it, honestly. Have you heard about it? No. No. I had no idea that. I didn't know. Okay. And I used to work in immigration law for oh. seven years. Oh. So. Okay. okay. I guess it hasn't gotten a lot of publicity. Yeah, it's, it's been just only 10 days. Oh, yeah. Oh, I honestly, I don't, I don't really get into it, okay. any, anything like that. Um, Did you hear about it? No. no. Evet efendim, Laguna Beach'ten güneşli bir günden. Evet, sokak röportajımızı yaptık. Biz seviyoruz İlkay'la sokak röportajı yapıp Amerikalılara soru sormayı. Bayılıyoruz. Gündem hakkında soru sormayı. Böyle bir gündem vardı. Evet. Aha. Amerikalıların bir nabzını tutalım. Ne diyorlar diye düşündük ama düşünen yok, <gülüyor> bilen yok. <gülüyor> Bir tane avuk adamca çotu çotu cevap verdi. Evet, o, o gayet o şey biliyordu konuya tak, tak, hakimdi. Tak tak tak arka arka Evet. Çoğunun bilgisi yok. Yani sen diyorsun ya işte Amerika çok büyük bir ülke. Evet. En batısındayız buraya gelene kadar hey yavrum hep belki ondan. Belki yani belki de şu an güneş batıyor millet voleybol oynuyor evet. bilmiyorum. Mesela bir, birisine soru sordu dedi ki ya bu kadar politik soruyorsunuz ben de ne bileyim Laguna'da güzel güneşin keyfini çıkartacağınızla ilgili bir soru soracaksınız falan demiş. Hayat toz pembe falan yani kimilerine göre. Biliyoruz. Sevgili Nalan Apa ile beraber yeni bir uzaktan kumanda sokak, sokak röportajında, röportajında ya da sana bir et yedireyim mi ben ne yapayım? <gülüyor> <gülüyor> bir Adana alıyor Los Angeles'ta et yedirmek. Aa, Adana Adana falan burada Adana'lılara sevgim saygım sonsuz. Ben Adana'da krize giriyordum bu arada. Neden yani? Bir yemek getirdiler yıllar önce Adana'da evet. yedim yedim dediler ki abi ana yemek ne alacaksın dedim. Ananın... <gülüyor> Ana yemek ne dedim ya? Bunlar ne olacak dedim. Doğru yere gitti. Abi dedi bunlar başlangıç. Oo dedi biz nereye düştük? Ben şu omuzlarım aşağıya düştü benim. Senin. Doktor dedi ki hmm. mide zarı dedi oradan geçer dedi o aşağı çeker dedi. Vallahi billahi ciddiyim. Şaka değil yani doktor olanlar varsa biliyordur. Ölüyordum ya. Hakikaten yani de nasıl yediğimi de bilir herkes. Onun kaç katı yedim. Sana bir burger ya da et yedireyim. Tamam Hadi anlaştık. Bakalım. Bir uzaktan kumandanın yeni bölümünde hem biraz sokak röportajı yaparız hem, hem de, de bir örgüleri yeriz. Gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgüm gümgü